Hi, I'm Grant Banbury and I'm here at the Agintyre Art Gallery to talk about this particular work here by a North Island based artist, Terry Stringer. Terry was born in Cornwall in 1946 and came to New Zealand and has established a really significant career as a contemporary sculptor. The feature in this work really is um, that it's made on quite heavy paper. It's called Shell on a Windowsill and was produced in 1985. Terry initially worked with wood and created sculptures, quite figurative sculptures, and then moved on to working with bronze. He has produced a large range of work in bronze which often deal with perspectives on the figure. He has a strong interest in art history and dips back into that and includes that um, in his art practice. This particular work, the features of it is that he's working with coloured pencil and in a way he's made out of this paper a three-dimensional sculpture. Probably not so easy to see but we'll include a closer shot of this to show the three-dimensional nature of it. It's in a Perspex box to keep it very clean. And this work, I imagine, was purchased from his dealer, the Brook Gifford in Christchurch, in, in Christchurch uh, where Terry had <coughs> exhibited many times. His early work develops planes of light, if you like, working with a sort of cubist faceted uh, approach to the figure and in more recent times his work has become more rounded in its forms. He's interested in multi perspectives uh, of the figure. His sculptures, some of them may stand up to um, two meters high and you can walk right around them. This is one of three works in the collection here by this artist and going back to the work itself the shell at the bottom projects out and you've got a sense of sort of unknown forms behind. They're very sculptural, there is a sense of shadow perhaps coming across it and he's built up um, very subtle colour relationships using blue, red and um, orange and brown coloured pencils um, almost like colouring in. There's a sense of light here in this area and um, it sits on a pretty plain cream background um, and it's a very, very subtle work um, to take in. You need to come up very close to it to see how he's worked with the coloured pencils and these very delicate fine lines um, that run across it. Um, he has had many um, creative New Zealand funding grants over the years and as an artist who's been very lucky to work for the majority of his life uh, full time. He has lived north of Auckland uh, in a property that he built with his partner Tim um, called Zealander and these days is now based back in Auckland. Uh, now he's in his 70s and still works away daily uh, on his work. It's a very lovely work to have in the collection and it's very nice that um, more than one work is here at the Agintyre. Thank you.